Getting a robot to fly is impressive, but once it's in the air, how do you keep it there without draining too much energy? Nature's answer is perching. Think of perching as landing without a runway. Birds, bats, and insects do it. They can land on narrow surfaces, upside down or right side up, remain idle for long periods of time, and then take off by launching themselves from different positions. Now, researchers have made a robotic insect that can perch by using electro-adhesion. The tiny robot is adorned with an electrode patch that can create a static charge for attaching to surfaces. It's a similar principle to static cling from a balloon. This type of adhesion is pretty weak, so objects must be really light for them to stick to a surface. To get around that limitation, scientists designed these robots to weigh a minuscule 84 milligrams. That's less than a bee. At this weight, it takes a thousand times less power to perch than to fly. The lightweight electrode patch combined with a flexible shock-absorbing mount enables the robot to perch on a variety of surfaces, glass, wood, and even a leaf. To detach, the electricity is turned off, allowing the patch to discharge. Once they can fly tetherless, these perching robots could be used to provide bird's eye views of disaster areas, detect hazardous chemicals, or enable communication in remote regions. Future designs could allow for perching on vertical surfaces, which means we could have our first robotic fly on the wall.